Hello, my name is Denise Ward and I'm a Toastmaster and Celebrant. I'm taking part in the 30 Day Business Challenge. Today I'd like to talk to you about how to present yourself when you're doing a speech, especially um, at functions. I see a lot of speeches and on the whole they're pretty good and it's fun to do one, but it's also nerve wracking. One thing I would say to you about nerves is, don't worry, everybody else is on your side normally at occasion like this, so you can afford to relax a little bit. Part of relaxing is in the preparation. You need to rehearse, rehearse, prepare as much as you can so that you know your speech inside out. If you know your speech inside out, then when, when there's a problem with it, you should be able to get yourself back on track. But remember, you're the only one that knows your speech inside out, so even if it's a bit ropey, um, you can still carry it off if you smile. I do that all the time. Um, I'd also like to talk to you about technique. When you're giving your speech, you may be using the PA system. If you've got a microphone, this is actually a telephone, but I'm using it as a microphone for demonstration, is put it by your chin here. And if you put your hand behind your back, then you've got a lovely steady position. Um, and that will come across very clearly. A lot of people do all this when they're talking, just because they're nervous or they might twiddle with their hair. Um, you want to try to avoid that because it will come across diffi um, quite difficult to, to hear. The other thing you might want to think about is where you stand. If you stand in front of the PA system, um, in other words, away from the speakers, you're less, less likely to get some sound back. The content of your speech should be as short as possible and try not to be offensive um, and rude and just be careful with your language that it doesn't alienate people or that if you are making jokes that they're appropriate to the audience. For instance, if, you, um, if you've got um, people from different cultures, you don't want to make a joke where half of the people need to have it explained. Um, keep it light-hearted and try to keep it short. My name's been Denise Ward and I hope those um, tips have been useful. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, then we can keep in touch and maybe I can help you some more. Thank you. Bye-bye.